Five minute Disney villain stories. Disney, The Little Mermaid, Coral Festival Chaos. Ursula the sea witch was always grumpy, but that day she was in an especially foul mood. She was deep in her lair with flotsam and jetsam. What day is it today? She called to the eels. It's the beginning of the Coral Festival. Flotsam and Jackson said in unison. It was time for King Triton's annual choral festival when all the rural people gathered together to celebrate the beauty and splendor of the ocean's coral. The merfolk loved the festival, but Ursula despised the celebration. Too much joy, complained the villainess. Ursula peered through her crystal ball and scowled as she watched King Triton welcome his guests. How kind of you all to join us. My daughters and I have a fun field festival planned for you. The merfolk cheered and clapped for the exciting day ahead. I can't wait for the race, exclaimed one mermaid. My favorite event is the water ballet. Another chimed in. Nothing beats the parade, said a third. Know what would make me happy? sneered Ursula, making those cheery mer people unhappy. Flotsam, Jackson, we've got a coral festival to spoil. Starting with that silly sea race, she whispered her plan to her eels and they swam off to Atlantica. King Triton and all his merfolk friends gathered outside the castle gates to watch the race. Little did they know Ursula and her minions were watching too. One, two, three. The mer people swam by at amazing speeds. They swam around rocks and between coral, racing for the finish line. But Ursula was ready for them. She hid behind the biggest rock and waited. As they passed, Ursula stretched out her mighty tentacles and thrashed them, hoping to scare off the merfolk. But the giant wave only helped the races swim faster. The mer people clapped and cheered for the winners of the race. Ursula watched in frustration as King Triton awarded trophies to them, but she had more tricks up her sleeve. <laughs> Not to worry, I have an even better idea. Ursula said with a cackle, noticing the dancers in the distance. We're going to rock the water ballet. So Ursula, Flotsam and Jackson snuck into the concert hall where the orchestra played a soft, soothing tune. On stage, the mermaid ballerina spun, swayed and sashayed in sync with the music. Ursula snickered. These poor, unfortunate dancers are about to lose their rhythm. She placed a racket on the phonograph. The racket's loud rock music drowned out the sound of the symphony. Now the choral festival will be spoiled, for sure, she sneered. As the new beat filled the concert hall, all the dancers looked at each other, confused. Then, one by one, everyone began to catch on. The dancers started rocking out to the brand new song. In her hiding place, Ursula frowned. 
Once again, Ursula's evil plan had backfired. The audience tapped their fins to the catchy beat and cheered on the dancers. Those cheery merfolk are enjoying the choral festival more than ever. Harumph Ursula as she shattered the photograph rackets. That's when Ursula saw King Triton swish by. Of course, it's time for the parade. She cried with an evil twinkle in her eye. That's how I'll spoil the festival. We'll build our own fleet and join the procession. She plotted. The merfolk will be so scared when I appear. Oh my, this is going to be fun. The parade's roots woven through a glorious reef covered in coral. All the merfolk gathered around watching all. They applauded as the flates went by carrying the champions of the race and the dancers, who all waved as they passed. Ursula hurried to join the parade, but the finale began before she could catch up. All the colourful coral opened, creating a brilliant spectacle that blocked the sea witch's way. The merfolk oohed and awed at the vibrant colours. They all agreed that this had been the best coral festival yet. No! Ursula cried. She had failed to spoil any of the fun at the coral festival. The mer people were happier than ever. In the foulest mood, Ursula rode away on her float back to her lair to form her next evil plan.